Okay. So at first I was freaking out a little bit. I thought, is this someone's yard? Because there's a house there. But uh, I saw a woman and I said hello and she didn't say anything back. So that means it's probably good for me to walk. Um, there's already a body of water. You can hear the sound of water. So I'll show you. Hi, there I am. Hi. 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 Alrighty, so this is not only going to be a reflection on the adventure I took, but overall the adventure that life has been bringing me through. And it is beyond beautiful, but also just like this time spent in this random nature preserve I found unexpected and scary and I'm not sure what exactly is lurking but it's beautiful and I'm thankful and I'm thankful to get to take an opportunity to really sit and think about how I feel and how the world has shared these experiences with me. Sometimes I don't know who to turn to, even though I know that we're surrounded by an all-omnipotent source that knows everything about us, and so I make these videos, and I talk to you. Of course, I don't know what I'm going to talk to. I don't know why I was even here feeling this tree in the sensual way I was. I'm not sure why I feel the way I do when I used to be really ashamed and I had too many feelings and people told me to stop crying and so I stopped crying and I slowly became kind of detached I and, I, I'm not really wearing and then I felt really connected in, in another way but and hey, I could take a jump in I'm probably just ranting too. but Sometimes it's nice to get lost and know that you're safe. To go. And sometimes it's nice to know that this experience is temporary. And we're all going down our paths for a reason. <sighs> so let's take a deep look into the darker parts of my mind that I've been meditating on. Love is something scary. Uh, I don't know why I feel it to say that maybe it's scary knowing that even though the two become one, there will be a time where there will just be one left. <sighs> So, are you ready to learn a life lesson from Esther that she's learning as well? I feel sometimes I'm running away from my shadow and that it's something I have to escape and clear like a level in a game and sometimes I find myself in situations and places where I don't even know how I got there but on many levels I do on many levels I know exactly why I'm there I have felt very overwhelmed for a lot of my life, as many people do, thinking that it was normal to feel that way. And 
finding ways to understand that maybe it's not normal and maybe I do need to stop and help myself and reflect on what normal means for me during this time because <sighs> I don't want to look back and regret any silly mistakes or I suppose even if I do run back that's for a reason as life cycles but really I want to be able to run with confidence knowing that I am safe and protected and that God and Source has my highest best intention and that I am living my life with a strong foundation and that the normal is even if things change as they will there will still be a strong foundation to rest upon within the chaos of the change saving grace to learn and to grow and to pick the fruits that I sow knowing that in the end that is how life is meant to be I just pray I'm planting the right kind of seeds I like to sit and flow and understand that I'm just a part of the universe and that as I move it moves and together we are one and I want to be vulnerable and I want to be protected and I want to protect what I love and the love that God and Source has given me and the abundance I see in all we are all here for a reason and I guess the moral of the story is we don't have to know exactly the full reason why but it okay, will be revealed. Okay, welcome. My phone's about to die. <sighs> I just wanted to say thank you for joining me on today's adventure and um, it's been really nice and opening and <sighs> freeing and I hope that you enjoy this. Uh, let me know if you want more like this or or whatever. I kind of liked it, so you probably will see more. And uh, I hope that you have a good day. Namaste. <sighs> mm.